turbines dotting the farming landscape. And no, it's not Europe. Five wind farms have been established as part of the first phase of the Independent Power Producers program in the Eastern Cape. A total of 1,850 megawatts of electricity is expected to be generated by 2016. The first supply will be available within weeks. Investment during the first two phases will exceed 6 billion rand. We've seen a transfer of skill, we've seen a new technology come into the area, we're seeing a whole new sector of business open up to us for the future in phase one. Turbine parts and equipment are currently being imported. A new manufacturing plant near Port Elizabeth will fill the gap. We'll definitely focus internationally, um, starting off on a local, uh, local market, focusing then on the neighboring countries like Mozambique, Namibia and so forth, and then moving into Africa, Kenya is a possibility, and then after that maybe international market, who knows. The wind farms have created more than a thousand temporary jobs. Local residents are set to benefit in the long term too. Each wind farm must put at least 2% of its dividends in a trust for communities surrounding a wind farm. There is also communal shareholding in various projects. We appreciate it so much. It would also help us, the people who doesn't have in future, so that to have enough electricity that can support the whole community of which is going on. We're using paraffins for cooking everything. We haven't got anything like electricity. We're happy. More than that, uh, they promised us to kind of assist us to change our lives, you know, because uh, we got no jobs in that area. The additional electricity supply will help stabilize the national grid. Good news for local businesses and potential investors. Yuri Blachnot, SABC News, Port Elizabeth.